Webster University community gathered on October 6th for Disability Awareness Month. Beatball gives a chance for the visually impaired to play sports. Because with my disability, I don't have like I don't have many opportunities to play sports. So beatball and all those other sports, they really they give me that opportunity to play. The Academic Resource Center invited Mind's Eye to run the game. I'm here with Mind's Eye. We are an organization that works primarily with the blind and visually impaired, a radio reading service, and also we provide audio description. But every year in July, we have a beatball tournament here in St. Louis. Here are reactions from students. It was kind of scary. I had to like turn my head so I could hear better instead of like the usual stance of uh, looking forward or looking around. Running was probably the scariest part because you have no idea um, like where it is and so you're relying on people around you to yell at you like oh left, right or keep going straight as well as trying to hear the uh, post of the base. At first I was I could hear it as I was going towards it but as you get closer the beeping seems like it's going away in a way like if I'm going straight towards it, it sounds like it's going more to the right so then that's when people start yelling at you to make a left or something you right there you for the Webster journal this is Sara Banura